All right, what I'm going to try to demonstrate are the three positions that will be tested in this video, which are three relatively common positions for cyclists, uh, depending on their experience and the intensity of the riding. Uh, to start off with, this is sort of a casual position, uh, generally adopted by people that are either not serious about cycling or are at least not going quickly. Um, in this position, your arms are full length apart out on the handlebars. One leg is in the upstroke, the other is in the downstroke, and your body is upright. Often your head is upright also. Now, the second position usually involves putting both pedals level, and this is sort of a beginner's tuck where you slide back on the seat a little bit with your legs like this and lean forward. By doing this, you can reduce the drag something in the zone of uh, 10 to 15 percent at 20 miles per hour. But that's not really enough to be seriously competitive um, at pushing the limits on how fast your bike can go. The third position involves sliding the legs closer together toward the bike and removing the arms from the grips and either applying them like this as you tuck down very low bringing your elbows together or in front of your legs uh, or an alternative is instead of having the arms on the bars close together like this you can have one in the center and one under and then bring them down like this so that your arms are touching and pressed against your knees. Uh, if you want to go even more extreme, you can grab the bar here and lower yourself down like this. Uh, but in the video, I'm going to be testing with this position. 